Nina just won't stop. <laughs> <laughs> With the Halloween treats. Uh -huh. So at this point, not only have we done three specials dedicated to treats, we also did a few on the actual Halloween show. And now... I feel a little bit like a feeder. Just throwing that out there. <laughs> it is a bit. Yeah, it is. Is a that your maternal bit. instincts kicking in? You have to feed everyone. <laughs> it's it, one time she was accused of enabling fat people. <laughs> really? In a, in a post. We've all been accused of that at some point. In life, <laughs> at least you and Nina. Um, I enable a fat person every day. <laughs> <laughs> Self enabling. Um, so yeah, so we, we've got uh, uh, en Entenmans. 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 Entermans. So they're just, they're just, they look to me like they're just donut holes. Yeah, those are just donut holes in a Halloween box. But these pumpkin delights, I think, are a pumpkin. The apple in them, right? I was going to get fall cakes just for old time's sake, but um, I, I didn't see any in Lee's. Wow. Not fall, not, you know, there were zebra cakes, of course. Yeah. yeah. What were the fall Well, there's the like fall pumpkin trivia like? on the back of the don't, little don't Debbie box. they just box? have like orange sprinkles? It's just okay. enough to. Just, the, just very close to zebra cakes. All right. You guys want some zebra pumpkin trivia from the back of the box? Of course we do. The name pumpkin comes from the Greek word pepo, meaning large melon. Oh. Anybody know that? I did not. Okay. Uh, no. Pumpkins are a fruit that contain seeds, but when it comes to cooking, they're often referred to as vegetables. Now, how come tomatoes get credit for that all the time? They're yeah. like, did you know tomatoes are really a fruit, but you never hear about pumpkins? Mm. They never talk about pumpkins. And squash, for that matter, must be it too, right? And mm. cucumbers? Yeah. Cucumbers, out there. cucumbers a are a fruit. <laughs> I'm throwing that out yeah. there. That's Is, are they technically a melon? So pick, pickles are yeah, fruit. They are. Yeah. <laughs> Delicious fruit. <laughs> the large Those are fruit. vinegar fruit. <laughs> <laughs> the largest pumpkin ever recorded was in 2016 and weighed in at 2,624.6 pounds. That's a ton of pumpkin. Over 1 billion pounds of pumpkin are produced in the U.S. every year. Possibly less this year with the rising cost of pumpkin. Maybe Oof. supply and demand problem. A billion pounds. Did you get that? A billion pounds of pumpkin uh, are produced. Pounds. Pounds. A billion pounds. A pumpkin weighing 98 pounds. We'll sell it for a billion pounds. <laughs> um... Well, do you want to just try these these uh, little? I want to try this. Gunguses. Oh dear, they they look better on the box. They got smiley faces. Oh yeah, they look. Yeah, they look definitely better. Results on the may box. vary. Well, the the box makes it look more like an apple crispy kind of apple pie thing. Is there apple or is it like a pumpkin gel? Pumpkin yeah, gel. pumpkin like slime. Pumpkin slime <laughs> inside. <laughs> now with thirty percent more pumpkin, pumpkin slime. slime. <laughs> This is one of the part of that one billion pounds of pumpkin. Is there even any pumpkin in it? I'll let you guys know. <laughs> yeah, so there's this little. It's sad. It's, the mouth is pretty well defined, but the eyes are really. It, it smells heavily uh, spiced. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, my pumpkin. Yeah, I think it smells good. It smells. All right, let's try. My pumpkin has an like extra chromosome smell. here. There is pumpkin puree in it. Um, it definitely has the texture of those Pepperidge Farm cookies, which is yeah. not great. I like their discussion. Nice it's soft. better than the beverage from cookies, I think. I don't know. No? Frankie rejects outright. You know it's what? It's not for me, Jen. It gives me a Fig Newton yeah. vibe. That's it's got a that's Fig Newton texture it to it. It's like nice and soft. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's not better. awful. What, what would have made this though. better for you? Um, like a crispier, like a crunchier cookie? Yeah, first of all, that kind of that like soft... Uh, the best way I can describe outer it. spongy area. Yeah, that soft fupa, <laughs> that fupa kind of thing. Yeah, the pumpkins. Pussy. No, no, I, I, that, um, that kind of like almost gingerbread soft cookie thing that yeah. comes like those shitty oh, yeah, cheap cookies. Ginger. Um, i not. I don't really go in for that. And then the filling is gross and at the, at the worst. Yeah. but um, and bland and inoffensive at the best. I, I thought they were going to be a lot better based on the picture. Let me tell you that. Yeah. Well, the picture made me think I was going to get a nice little pastry. Instead, I've got like a crap cookie. But don't it reminds me of a cross between a molasses cookie mm -hmm. and a uh, Fig Newton. Is there molasses yeah. in it? I don't get much pumpkin at all from it, but I, I kind of like it. I bet you could leave that out on... <laughs> I bet you, you could leave that out on the counter. You could have ants all over it. It would still taste exactly the same <laughs> seven weeks later. There are yep. a lot. This cookie yeah, plus molasses. ants, you think, taste the same? Yeah, I don't think ants affect the taste. They're going to add some texture. Oops. Yeah. Ants and uh, ant poop. Yeah. Um, so out of ten pumpkins, how, do you, how many do you give this? Uh, two. Two? 
That bad, huh? Well, I mean, I guess it's not gross. I mean, f- three. I if give you, it five pumpkins. Yeah. If you were stuck on a <laughs> desert really island, should have introduced this rating system earlier. <laughs> like we've gone through a lot of. Good I stuff. just came up. <laughs> I'm sure we could retroactively assign most things have been like two of two to four pumpkins. We could add a graphic on later on. <laughs> I'd give it a solid seven point five pumpkins. Whoa, Zach, Zach you're okay it. with this thing? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. I'd oh yeah. Like, I'd say like a s- seven pumpkin, six or seven. Oof. Yeah. Oof. I don't believe you. I don't believe you. Don't believe that. that <laughs> my own rating you system. don't believe my opinion. <laughs> you don't believe in this rating system. I don't believe. <laughs> are we just going to dive right into these? I things? think so. Okay. I mean, y- these are clearly we'll not anything up. that we're that we don't know about. But you're not going to read the trivia on the back. Popums. But let's Why face is there it. Trivia. No. Donut holes. The ingredients are the universal the office holes. Uh, treat. And Entenmann's is a pretty high end brand. Um, they're still pretty expensive. Oh, okay. They got bats and pumpkins on the packaging. Yeah, is there anything Halloween tasting about this, or is it just no. different Halloween packaging? It's, it's an Entenmann's glazed donut hole. Mmm, they're good. Oh, they're mm. delicious, yeah. To my surprise. It'd be nice if there was a mix, if you had a little bit of your... Yeah, right, like a yeah. chocolate one, too. The picture shows mm. a chocolate one and a they glazed are good. one. Yeah, Entenmann's stuff is still premium quality. Now, compared to the cookies... Should I take over the show while you guys all eat donuts? Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you usually like donuts. I love donuts. We that were, is a really good We were criticized years ago for talking about pastries and treats around Halloween time too much. 